In every neighborhood, there is one house that adults whisper about and children cross the street to avoid. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Mario back here with SLC Nerds 31 Screams. Uh, now we're talking about an amazing film that you should check out if you're a Wes Craven fan, if you're a Haunted House fan, uh, of that kind of horror subgenre. Something's in here. We gotta get out of here, Leroy. The Wes Craven movie After Nightmare on Elm Street and before Scream, of course, he made People Under the Stairs, a little known horror movie. <laughs> It's about this little boy named Fool, that's actually the character's name, Fool, uh, finds this house with this weird mommy and daddy character, and they're actually called Man and Woman on IMDb. And there's people who live under the stairs, thus the name of the movie. And even though the name of the movie is accurate, the poster is not accurate, but it's a skull that is over a house, and the house is part of the movie. But man, is that poster a lie. But the, I think what's most memorable about the movie is some of the camera work. It goes in and out of walls. I think Wes Craven tries to do some, some fun stuff that wasn't necessarily uh, done at the time. Two other notable people in this film, Ving Rhames is in this picture. Two, three years before Pulp Fiction, depending on when they shot those mov respective movies. Of course, there's a man who plays man, Everett McGill. Everett McGill was the nice man in Twin Peaks, season one and two. Check out People Under the Stairs, starring some cool people. Wes Craven, great direction. But what goes on under the stairs? Um, some cool camera angles, and it's check out nightmare. People Under the Stairs this Halloween season. Mario DeAngelis for SLC Nerd, and uh, happy hunting, 31 Screams.